Okay, hello everyone, this is Mr. Rob Ronan here again, and thank you all so, so much for helping me get to 3,000 subscribers. That is such a crazy thing to me. And I thought, what better way to celebrate than make a sequel to the videos that you guys seem to enjoy the most? And they're pretty random. Today we're going to make a sequel to Happy Chaos's Dust Kinda Sucks A Lot. And in this video, Happy Chaos had just come out, like, literally 10 minutes ago. And I was just making a ton of random small videos just showing stuff about Happy Chaos. And in this one I was like, damn, his dust kind of has literally no range. Like, it doesn't connect off of any of his buttons when he's close up. It's, like, arguably one of the worst dust ranges in the game. But, obviously, his dust doesn't suck. Especially considering the fact that he has the easiest time out of anyone in the entire roster comboing off of his dust. His un uncharged dust, specifically. Most characters, they have to RC their uncharged dust in order to get a combo off of it. Someone that can combo off of it for free is Zato, but he has to have Zeddy, um, Eddie out already before he does the dust in order to combo off of it. But Happy Chaos, anytime he's, he does a dust, whether it's uncharged or not, he's gonna get a combo from it as long as you have bullets, because he can just do his dust and then combo into his bullets. So even though this move has kind of awful range, it obviously makes up for it with massive, massive utility and cheap combo potential and mix-up potential, free mix-up combo potential, all that weird, all those words together, it's really good. So yeah, this move has kind of all for range, it doesn't really link into dust off of any of the regular dust link combo, um, or gatlings, like his, either of his kicks. His close slash can work if you're right, right next to the opponent. Yes, it can be different if, I, the, if I'm running in. If I have running momentum, obviously, I'll be able to link it or connect it off of my kicks, but Something I didn't take into consideration in that first video is that if my opponent is crouching, their hitbox is a little bit larger down low. So if I do my crouching K when the opponent is crouching, it's actually going to connect now. Same with my standing K, it will actually connect. And this is a big deal. If the opponent is blocking low, meaning they're going to get hit by it because it's an overhead, then it connects and you get a combo. So, and that's when you really want it to connect, when you actually get a combo for it. So that is kind of a big thing to take into account. If your opponent is crouching, and you do the dust, you're going to be able to link off of it, and you're going to get a combo for it, because you can combo for it using the guns. But yes, this dust can be connected off of all of his dust linking things, whether it's by using his running momentum, or by using um, a crouching character's extend, like, slightly larger hitbox. Or, obviously, you can always get this thing by just running up and doing it raw. Just that That's what really makes the opponent scared of you. If you run up and do a raw dust, you're a scary man. Okay, so, if I get Kai to block the dust in the corner, obviously, something I can do is just something like this. I can just go into my pressure, keep it safe, and then run in for a throw, do whatever I want, really. <laughs> the world's your oyster. As long as it's blocked, you do a gunshot, you're plus, now you've just got whatever pressure you'd like to do with Happy Chaos, you can go in. Freak the opponent out, go for grabs, go for 5k, 6k shot, 5k, 6k shot pressure. You can even go into your steady aim stance to get some weird pressure going on there. Wouldn't really recommend it, just go for some normal stuff. But just the fact that he's able to off of his dust, keep it safe, and not only to keep it safe, keep it plus, keep his pressure going, go for some mix-ups and pressure strike throws in the corner, and your opponent's just really scared, and not only have they just blocked your dust, they're like, oh phew, I'm out of it. Mm -mm, they're not out of the ringer. Now you're on top of them, now you've got your pressure going, now it's even worse than they were before. So if your opponent does end up getting hit by the dust, you can combo with it using your gunshot in two ways. You can either do it quickly so that you get an aerial combo, you can do something like this. And use your steady aim stance in the combo to get a bit of extra extension from the combo in the corner. And then use your focus and your deus ex machina if you want to get your bullets back. But you didn't really spend that many. Or you can also just delay the gunshot a little bit and get a grounded combo. Maybe you can do this if you like getting wall slumps. Or if you just want to build back more resources. Because obviously when the opponent is stuck on the wall in a wall slump, they're stuck on the wall for longer. So you can do a focus and a bullet regen and then break the wall and get some cool stuff going that way. That way you have time to build back some focus and some bullets, or you could go for a wall slump reset, because when the opponent is a wall slump, they can't take off of the wall and go flying in random directions. So you can go for some more crazy wall pressure like that. But yeah, really, the sky's the limit. When you combo off of it using your gunshots, you can either have the opponent in the air, go for an aerial combo using your steady aim stance, 
or you can keep them on the ground, and if they block it, you're at advantage, you're plus. He's really ridiculous when it comes to comboing off of his dust, and just getting pressure off of his dust. And I totally take back saying that his dust sucks, because obviously it has small range, but it has so much utility that it by far exceeds making up for it. it. It makes it so awesome and so unique. And he's a super ca unique character already, but this just makes him even more so unique. Anyways, that's Happy Chaos. He can combo off of his dust, and his dust is amazing. He's a super fun character. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for 3,000 subscribers. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.